Hello everyone, welcome to Yarpedia Global. So in this video, I'm going to discuss one very important update on scholarship opportunity for different discipline students. So we will see who all are eligible to apply for this scholarship and what is the deadline and how many students can get this scholarship or this foundation scholarship. So since last few years, what we see whenever student wanted to go abroad or global stage to complete his higher education, be it master's or PhD, the biggest constraint or barrier is the financial assistance. The very first question he asked to us as a mentor that is, sir, will I be getting the program where I will get fully funding or scholarship assistance? So the answer is yes. So today I'm going to discuss one such opportunity. You can see here on the screen, it is in Lark Shiv Dasani Foundation Scholarship. And it's clearly mentioned here every year, this scholarship is granted for 480 Indian students to read at top rated USA, UK, European institution in full time masters, MPhil or doctoral program. It's clearly mentioned here, right? And the amount is also mentioned here. Now the point is which all discipline or which courses student can apply, this scholarship is well suited and best for whom. So it's clearly mentioned here, you can see, if you are from social science background, humanities, law, fine art, architecture and related subject then you are eligible and even if you're coming from mathematics background sciences background environment background then also you are eligible to apply for this scholarship or this foundation scholarship to support your financial education or to support your education and get some financial assistance so guys it's clear now every year 480 indian student will be getting this funding or this scholarship now what is the procedure deadline i mentioned here 6th of February it's already started and the last date is 22nd of March. Now what are the conditions, what are the eligibility and what all formalities or documentation you need to do while applying for this scholarship. It's clearly mentioned you can see here. Let me go through the minimum percentage requirement is you must have Minimum academic background of 65%, CGPA 6.8 out of 10 and GPA 2.6. We have seen many times students ask, they approach us, sir, our CGPA is less than 7. So can I get some scholarship for funding opportunity? Yes, this is the opportunity there for you if you're coming from humanities, social sciences, law, fine arts, sciences, environment, chemistry and mathematics background, then you can apply for this scholarship. It's mentioned here, right? Now going ahead. If you're from the mathematics, sciences, environment, then you must have at least 70% or CGP of 7.2 out of 10 or GPA 2.8 out of 4 from the recognized university or institution. Now it's clear. It's essential to have prior admission to the institution and course chosen at the time of application. The foundation will not consider candidate without evidences of the admission. See. If you're applying for this scholarship, you must have some admission letter or admit letter from some particular university for some courses, which I quoted just now or just before, right? So these are the some constraints. Now, what is the procedure? The procedure is there. The application form consists of seven section, personal information, proposed program, university education, your work experience, statement of purpose, reference and declaration. So guys, these two points, your CV and statement of purpose is the point basically where your PDA Global mentor can help you. We have seen in the past also for international education, be it to get the admit from the university or to apply for external scholarship, your documentation play very, very important role. You need to write them in very well appropriate and relevant way. They must speak about your ability, potential, skill and past experiences. See, if they are not presenting yourself best, then you may lose the chances of selection or getting that scholarship. So make sure whenever you are writing these prerequisite document, take the help or mentorship of some expert faculty or fellows or mentors who already have traveled this journey. So the mentors at your PDA Global will be helping you people in the well proper way how to write the document as per the prerequisite of that particular scholarship. So I hope this is all for this. So if you are coming from these background, fine art, law, architecture, sciences, environmental, mathematics, etc. You believe you have done MSc, you want to go abroad for higher education and you want to go master in this area, then this is the deadline. You don't have any funding from the college, 
funding from the university but you are looking for the external funding opportunity in Lakshiv Dasani Foundation scholarship is one of them don't miss it go apply well before the deadline that is 22nd of March so we wish you all the best we will keep on coming more such interesting update till now thank you